we are underway. Adelaide United kicking things off. And the Negro keeping that spot ahead of Lee Broxham, who was favoured to take it pre-season. Kiddo's delivery, free header! Baba Diawara puts the Reds in front. They fired a warning shot earlier on, but Baba Diawara didn't waste his chance. Prominent headlines, but he's responded. And Baba Diawara, wow, what a snapshot on the turn. How about that for technique? It's a nice turn from Troisi on his right boot, the deflection and the save. Paul Izzo got across and tipped it around his post. Yeah, not sure if it was going in, but it's a terrific save if it is. So that deal cut short. Here's an opportunity, Leroy George, and Elsie gets the block in. Garrier wants the penalty, and the spot kick has been given. What's the card? Comes off his leg onto the arm. We've seen that in recent days, saying that you get the benefit of the doubt in that situation. Best start, Barisha, Paul Lizzo makes a stunning save onto the bar, and then a follow-up save to deny Leroy George. They want another penalty, there's nothing doing. It's all happening at Etihad. What a save. Williams spotted him, now Negro around the corner for George, who typed his run, got rid of his IES2, all the way through to Mark Milligan, flicks it up for himself, oh what a goal, Mark Milligan, what about the skill level there, it's a captain's goal, and the equaliser from the former skipper. Mille Usnich, beautiful move, opens up some space, block one! Weaving a little magic out there on the right wing. He's getting the congratulations, rightfully so. And all that misery at Etihad, you've got to credit how many Adelaide United supporters have made the trip for this Friday night game, Robbie. It's a fantastic turnout. They do every year. Oh, Adlong, he's the one on a yellow card. And he's off. And they're down to 10. Kurt Ams, she's got to go back and go, that's right. You were the case of mistaken identity first time, but not this time, you're off. He was in if Caruccio had found a way through. He's taking the time to show off his juggling skills, and Kurt Ham says, I'd rather you take the throw in a bit quicker. And have a yellow card. Oh, it's, off. it's a red card, they're down to nine. Ben Garuccio picks up his second yellow card for time wasting, and the Reds are seeing red at every turn right now. With the rest of the round to go. Triple header Saturday night. how it's done. That's how you flight one over the top. Botiak, penalty maybe. He's thinking about it, Sean Evans. It's still going on. Corey Brown blazes over. And the referee says, I waved off the penalty appeals and you had a beautiful chance to score anyway. Now Pepper trying to pick up Mullen. Header, Kalogerovic. Earns another corner tipped over by Jamie Young. Brisbane really are dropping deep here and Daniel Mullen has a crack. Now Vitasic will have a go. Beautiful strike. Wonderful save. Jamie Young down so smartly to his left. Good solid hand. Another chance brewing here for right Denson. And Jamie Young got a hand on it. Has another go and he knows where Hingard is. The back heel comes off as well. Hingard across the face. Macaroni. Really difficult to get the right connection. He had a crack. He's had a pretty good game for Utsky, but not his finest moment. <laughs> Scapettis into the back of Doyle. And Thomas Doyle didn't need to get involved there. Sean Evans and the assistant both come in. Flashpoint out of nowhere. Scapettis copping the sanction. He looked relieved. Scapettis looked relieved, didn't he? If he stamps, if he stamps, it's a red card, but it's just a stand, isn't it? He's played this one through. Gamero, flag staying down, and that's how he makes the one-on-one -on -one save. Oh, it's a great save. Particularly early on, here's Bobo, beautifully found by Mirzajewski. Here's Carney. Bonavaccia got level with him, palmed away by Jenjetovic. And Mirzajewski drills it in. And Sydney FC had the derby advantage in the 14th minutes. The Sky Blues in pole position, thanks to the pole. 
Martin in an attacking set. Sahuno off the frame of the goal. Still alive for Risson, or was it? Flag was up, and it was over the top in any case from Lachlan Scott. Brilliant from Sahuno. They must have judged a save by Andrew Redmayne there. Yeah. Stilling it behind here. Brosk! Oh, teed up superbly by Wiltshire. Bye bye. It's lovely stuff. It's Brosk. It's two. Gorgeous goal by Sydney FC. They were patient. They probed. And eventually they were clinical. And Alex Brosk has his first goal of the season. It is going to be Mirzajewski. Oh, it's three. And the derby might be won before half time. A double for the pole. Sydney FC in heaven. The Wanderers would love for him to have been fit. That's a beautiful layoff by Brosk. Babo advancing. Brosk could be in for a second. Janjetovic keeps the score line at just three for now. They want to take him quickly and short. And here's a Yeski then whips it in. Oh, he's got an own goal. Of Lachlan Scott. And Sydney FC do have four. Wow. Hard not to feel sorry for the Wanderers striker. But Sydney don't care. Rather surprising selections made by Gombau in his starting 11 tonight. And here they come again, Sydney FC. Here's Ieski, who's been everywhere. Bross couldn't reel it in. Zula's going to have a go. It's five! Is that goal going to be robbed off? Yeah, well, he's used yeah. his hand to... Good spot. Brandon O'Neill still full of running. Brandon O'Neill trying to place it! Wonderful! A pinch! scores and ends at Stadium in the derby as he did last season in round one and that's a beauty Santalab thinking about having a go here oh he thumps the post Brandon Santalab well he clearly thought blow this nobody else could score so I might as well have a go Harold quick throw Nichols flicks it on so close Moss had to knock it away he just spoke about him Jamie Harnwell and he almost made an immediate impact, Mitch Nichols. Well, the Jets have had 23 more shots and scored 10 more goals in the glory so far. As Mills whips this one in, and there's Mills scoring for the glory. Opening things up here at NRB Stadium. And Joe Knowles opens his account in the Hyundai A-League, scoring his first career goal, and it was a beauty. It's Torres sends it flat, bouncing away, Harold was there, tough one to control, it was flying at him fast. Wilson's ball. Nice one now to Elise Walker, who hits it first time. Enough glory shorts there in the area, but Hoffman didn't clear it. Well controlled by Nichols, down to Chris Harold, who just flashes it over the top. That's wonderful football from Perth Glory. And here is the moment the Glory fans have been waiting a few weeks to see. Diego Castro back into the action. Next moments for the glory defence. Ball set in. Donovan flicked it on. And it's teed up here. It's put into the bottom corner. Katrumbus has equalised for Newcastle. A great finish after the ball bobbled up. They were searching and searching Newcastle. And finally, they have broken through. Tratos to send the corner in. Decent ball flicked on. For the glory as the Jets get two in the blink of an eye. The ball deflecting away in the area. Yeah, any better with a corner from the other side. Floated in by Bratton and at the far post was McCormack off the line initially and then Ben Kennedy made the save from Stefan Mork. Gerald gets the better of Liam Rose who's caught wanting again and they could be in here. McCormack feeding Mork and he didn't get hold of it and Ben Kennedy got enough on the ball to put it behind for a corner. Second of the league in terms of save percentage. Bratton's corner whips across the face of goal and the deflection I think might have come off a Mariner's foot. Interesting battle uh, against Josh Rose. Youngster against the veteran. Jakobsen, this looks promising. Jakobsen, Kennedy again. Well, at the moment, Ben Kennedy is the difference. Dean Bazanis has had a very quiet evening so far. It's a lovely release. Here's Bratton, bit of space opening up. Puts it into the path of McCormack! First goal from open play for Ross McCormack. The deadlock is broken.
Duncan just before the hour mark and it's the Scotsman with his seventh goal of the season. Berry, this is better from the central coast. That was a good effort by Blake Pell because he had to take it almost behind him. The Mariners back in possession as we move to four minutes of stoppage time. Bahar just crossed, dangerous one, not for the silver. Connor Payne, brilliant block, absolutely superb block by Stefan Mork.